Uh, let's see, great crowd here tonight. Do we have any uh, military folks? Any veterans, anything like that? I saw some hands over here. Round of applause, give it up for these guys. Thank you guys. Out there. Did I see, was that your hand over here? What, what, what was your job? Or... I was a corpsman. Corpsman, cool, that's a good one. Were you good at it? <laughs> yeah, good. That's good. I only asked because I was faking it the whole time I was in from 1998 to 2003. Uh, <laughs> like, I'm not the troops that you clap for. I, the Marine Corps was no place for a stand-up comedian, it turns out. I, I, tried, I, just, I got in a lot of trouble the whole time. I, I got, I did, I got busted down. I lost rank three times while I was in. I, I got out honorably though, because they liked me. They just had to do their job. You know, they were like, that was hilarious, Knowles, but we gotta write you up on that shit. <laughs> it's funny, but we can't do that. I was always in trouble, man. I was in trouble literally day one. The very first morning of boot camp, five minutes after wake up, I was in trouble. Drill instructor right in my face, rawr, yelling at me. He was mad just because I had a boner in the morning. Like, you know, it wasn't because of anything weird, it's natural. It was just, I, it was a fast wake up. I didn't have time to do anything. It was just like in the movies. He had a trash can lid and a stick, and he's banging it. Get up and get out of bed. And I was like, here we go, son of a bitch. All right. It's, uh, it's true. I wish that was just a joke that I go around telling, but that's a memory that I live with. It's true. <laughs> This stuff, man. It was very embarrassing. He, he tried to embarrass me. He wanted me to be embarrassed. He called me out in front of everybody. He, Why are you hard, Knowles? Why are you guys not? It's morning. I'm 19. I'm sorry. This is gonna happen, man. He was so mad about it. Boot camp was such a culture shock for me, though. Like, I was completely out of my element. It was just, I mean, you can't imagine how different it, I, like, just in a couple of days, I flew from Southeast Texas, flew out to San Diego, they shaved my head, stripped me down, they gave us new clothes. Like, it was weird. Like, I remember getting ready for bed, they're like, here's how you sleep in boot camp. We put on these clothes, and they gave us tidy whitey underwear and little t-shirts, and they made us tuck our t-shirts into the underwear. <laughs> Why would they make us do such a cute thing? Why? We looked like we were wearing Marine Corps underoos. Like, let's way over here, line up, here we go. Running around, line up over here, here we go. And they made us stamp our name on all of our clothes. Give us a rubber ink stamp and stamp our shirt and our shoes and our socks and even the tidy whitey underwear. Like, they made us stamp them right on the front, which was messed up. Because we're trying to learn each other's names and shit. It's best, you know what I mean? We just got there, like, nice to meet you, Garcia. <laughs> Why are we doing this? So day one, old Knowles had morning wood. My tiny ones. He, he made an example out of me. He made me stand at attention in the middle of the squad bay. In my underwear. He, he made everyone else do push-ups. And he's just marching around like, everybody's gonna keep doing push-ups until Knowles' boner goes away. That's a lot of pressure for a young man. Just trying to wish it away, like, ah, I'm sorry. Everybody was mad at me because they had to do like 400 push-ups. <laughs> it took a long time, I don't know why it took so long. It's just a weird feeling knowing that like 55 grown men are all upset about your boner. It's a strange feeling. It's like, well stop thinking about it, you guys. You just kept bringing it up, pointing it out, the drill instructor's like, you guys enjoying those push-ups? Yeah, well let's see how Knowles is doing over here. Oh, you're still turned on, aren't you? I was like, I'm not turned on, but quit breathing on it. Like, back up for a second. Either one of us. So that's what I did for our country. You're welcome. Yeah, that's the type of show. Yeah. 